Hello, welcome to Blackberry TV. If you are new here, please subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss our next video. Biography of Rock Mark Christian Kabori Burkina Faso is a francophone country that got independence on August 5th, 1960. It was formerly known as Upper Volta before it was renamed Burkina Faso on August 4th, 1984 by one of its leaders. Christian Kabori came on board as a different type of leader, a diplomat, elected into the office in 2015. He became the first non-interim president in 49 years, having no military ties. Kabori was born on April 25, 1957, in the capital of Burkina Faso. He was born with a silver spoon as his father was a banker, who later became minister under the regime of Maurice Yamiogo, the country's first president. He started elementary school in 1962 at the age of five and he received primary school certificate in 1968. Kabori went to one of the best high schools in the country, St. Jean Baptiste de la Selle. He was an excellent student, passing his O level in 1972 and baccalaureate in 1975. As soon as he finished from high school, he got admission to the University of Dijon to study economics, specializing in business administration. Kabori graduated in 1979 and by 1980, he got his master's degree. Every child's role model is that successful parent. And that was the case of Kabori, who followed in the footsteps of his father. He started his career as a banker with the International Bank of Burkina, BIB, the country's largest bank. Having worked for a few years with diligence, he was promoted to the position of general manager at the age of 27 in 1984. Kabori remained in that position until 1989, when he was called to serve in the government. Under Blaise Kapare's regime, he was first appointed Minister of State on February 16, 1989, a position he held for seven months before being appointed Minister of Transport in September 21, 1989. These ministerial positions were to prepare him for the political scene and by 1981-1982, he began contesting for elective positions. During the 1991 elections, he contested and by May 12, 1992, he was sworn in as member of parliament representing Kadigo region. Abori did well as a representative and in 1994, he was appointed Prime Minister. In 1996, he resigned as Prime Minister after joining the new political party, Congress for Democracy and Progress CDP, which will go on to become the ruling party. His achievements put him up for the party's leadership and he was made its first vice president. That same year, he was made special advisor to the president, a post he held until June 1997. Kabori, being one of the exemplary leaders of CDP, was elected as the National Secretary in August 1999. On June 6, 2002, he was elected President of the National Assembly. In 2003, he became the President of the party. But a year later, in 2014, he had issues with CDP as he and others were against the amendment of the constitution that will allow President Blaise Kampari stand for re-election in 2015. Kabori and others saw this as undemocratic and they left the party. On January 25, 2014, he formed a new party, Movement to People for La Progress, MPP, meaning People's Movement for Progress. And on July 4th and 5th, in a conference at the country's capital, he was nominated as the party's candidate for the presidential elections. He won the general elections on November 25th, 2015, with 53.5% of the votes. Kabori was sworn in on December 29th, 2015, as the president of Burkina Faso. He got married to Sika Bella while studying in France in 1982. They have three children. What's your take on Kabori as a Burkina B politician? Let us know in the comment section. Will it be ridiculous to subscribe to our channel? If no, please like this video, share and subscribe to our channel.